Hi guys, it's Katie. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a little Bath & Body Works haul from last week when they were having their $6 single wick candles and then I picked up a couple of other things. So if you're interested, just keep on watching. Okay, so the $6 single wick candle sale was a really, really good deal and there was some scents I wanted to try. So the first one I picked up was Tree Farm. I love this style of packaging, especially with the little reindeer dog. It reminds me of my dog. Um, this one was really nice. Um, my dad has actually been burning this one. So this is what it's looking like. Um, it, it just smells like you're out in the forest, basically. Um, I like this one enough that I might consider uh, picking one up for myself. And the packaging's really cute, too. And this single wick actually does have a decent throw in, like, a medium-sized bedroom. So I would recommend this one. The next one I picked up is Fresh Balsam. I do like this one. This one smells... Pretty similar to Tree Farm, but a little bit more piney and a little bit more strong. I had this in a three wick last last year, but it was a little bit too strong for me in the three wick. So I wanted to try it in the one wick for this year. Um, and also it's like a scent that's like very season specific. So I didn't want to have like a huge three wick and then get sick of it. So also, I love the packaging on this one. The next one I picked up was Hot Cocoa and Cream. Again, this is one that I like the scent of, but I feel like I could also like get sick of it. It smells exactly like Swiss Miss. <laughs> it makes you want hot chocolate. But I really, really do like this one. Um, I didn't really like the packaging on the three wick, which is another reason why I wanted to try the one wick. Um, but the packaging on this one's pretty cute, um, I think, with the little gingerbread house, and it smells really good. Again, I don't know the throw, how the throw will be, but it smells pretty strong, so I think even in a one wick, this will be pretty nice. The next one I picked up was Twisted Peppermint. I love the pink-colored wax on this one, and again, I love the dogs and the pink and red Christmas trees. Super cute. I've never had this scent before, but I'm really liking it in the body care. Um, so I'll probably burn this one tonight, actually. Um, but I wanted to try it in a one wick. And if I really end up loving it, I might pick it up in the three wick. But sometimes it's nice to just have one wick candles, especially if you have a candle collection. Um, they're smaller to store. Um, and it's just nice to not have so much, um, product if you're collecting a lot of candles. And then the last one, the last two I got, I got Sweather Weather, Sweather Weather. I don't think I've tried this one before. And unfortunately, I don't really like this one. Um, it's very light, kind of a fresh eucalyptus type scent was how I would describe it. I actually think I'm going to be exchanging this one. It's just not for me. Um, it's fine. I think it would be nice like in a bathroom, but I don't really light candles in my bathroom. I think I'm going to exchange this for Frozen Lake. I just like that one better. But again, the packaging is really cute on this. And then the last one I picked up, I was really excited about. It's Peppermint Sugar Cookie. I smelled the three wick in store and I really, really liked it, but the one wick does not smell the same as the three wick. This one does not smell nearly as good to me for some reason. So unfortunately, this is another one I'm gonna have to exchange. Um, I'm just gonna pick up the three wick instead of the one wick in the scent. This one smells Play-Doh-y to me. Very Play-Doh. I don't know why the three wick doesn't smell like that, but I saw some other people on the reviews of, I think, the one wick saying it smelled Play-Doh-y. So I don't know what is going on with this one, but the three wick one um, smells really good. So there is that. And then I did have an exchange. 
Um, I, ha I finally exchanged my peppermint, or not peppermint, my pumpkin cupcake spray that I didn't like, and I decided to exchange it for the Hope Winter Peace Marshmallow. I didn't pick this up originally because I'm not huge on peach scents, but um, I smelled this one in store and actually really liked it. I also smelled the Love and the Peace one, and I didn't care for either of those, but this one smells really good. It's like a light peach scent. So even if you don't like peach, you might like this one. Um, I think like the other notes in it save it, like the vanilla meringue and the creamy jasmine. To me, it kind of smells a little bit like a peach marshmallow, but the floral note kind of evens it out a bit. Um, and the packaging on this collection is really cute. So I did pick this up. And then I did have like a coupon for a free item. So I picked up the Joy Sugared Snickerdoodle and the Ultimate Hydration Body Cream. I love this packaging so much. I kind of want to get the candle in this too. Um, I'm really loving this scent this year and I have already been using it. It smells sort of similar to Christmas cookies, but a little bit different. Um, but I really liked the mist, so I thought I would pick up the lotion to go with it as well. It actually like perfectly meshes my nails. And then I did pick up a couple of pack pocket bags. Um, I picked up this winter one. It's just like a nice fresh scent, and I really liked the little penguin on it. And then I picked up another one. I don't remember what it was, but it was another like fresh wintry scent, but I actually gifted that to my mom. So yeah, that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know down below what your favorite uh, one wick candle is. I would love to know. And um, if you like these types of videos, give this video a like and consider subscribing. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.